I just bought a Slytherin shirt to represent my house, Team Slytherin. What are you? Boo, Hogwarts. No, what, Who are, what house are you? What house are you? Hogwarts. No, you're not. No. What house? Griffin. 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 <laughs> uh, Team Hufflepuff. Kristen and Mom are Hufflepuff. Dad and Gryffindor, like you always. Dad and Bradley are Gryffindor, and I am Slytherin. It matches. It is about 12.30. Just got here, our room isn't ready. We were trying to wait a little bit for it. Uh, but we left our bags of luggage services and we're gonna head to the parks. So we gotta eat some lunch. And see what today brings us. I'm gonna show you the view. <laughs> gotta walk down the stairs. <laughs> Over there, those two eyes are Dr. Doom's doom fall. Let me see if I can get those two too. Yeah, there's Dr. Doom's doom fall. And where is it? I'm going to venture is all, is that, is that little dot? A little, little tiny dot that has a little spike, and then that little green round thingy. If you can see it, it's a part of the coaster, and that's it. Now we're gonna go with other view. Mama's gonna tell me. And there's a little pool over there, and a little, little water slide. Wait, wait, wait till you don't walk. Okay, now show. There's a little pool and a little water slide. If you can see that. Wait, let me show you. Let me take you a little turn. It's over here. Wait, can you see it? It's, it's way over there. I don't think you can see it. And I don't know really much right now. Oh, um, there's. Oh, what is that called again? <laughs> see it? I don't know what you're showing me. See the little, the, 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 the peach? What was that right called again? Oh, that's the top of Jurassic Park. Yeah. Out in the distance, that tan building. Yep. There it is. If you could see it. Look. Yep. There's some nice chairs and oh, there's pool. And oh, the bird. Oh, sorry. I think I'm going to go on that when I go in there. I said, I'm gonna go on that wide side a hundred times. And there's all, all the rest of the hotel. Beautiful. I see you in the park. See you in the park. And we're walked the boat. Gotta go down here. Panda Express. I got the bowl orange chicken with chow mein, aka lo mein. Mom got some fried rice, and I think Krista got the same as me. And you do get your annual pass discount here. Time to head into studios. 
Universal's joining the ranks of Epcot with their walls. Monsters Cafe. Womp womp. I'm sad I missed the tribute store. The summer one. It was all the old rides. But getting ready for Halloween Horror Nights. And the mommy is still closed, but look at all of these team members out. So I'm really, 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 really hoping it opens while we're here. I came into Fast and Furious because it's usually the best AC in the park because this is the hottest day we've had so far. And there's no AC yet. Whew, it's hot today. So that's why we, we ran in here. But we are heading towards Ollivander's. Uh, Bradley has his robe and we're trying to get him picked. Get his I got this, Jamie. Okay, don't forget Doc, yours this time. What up? Just got a heads up from Hobbs. Who's Hobbs? The FBI is about to read the Wait, what? The FBI? Oh, man, they always ruining our fun. Well, stop hacking their surveillance noise. equipment. They're leaning over the Shaw right to your door. Wait, who? Shaw, that cockroach we beat down oh, the cockroach? Well, why are we What's worried? he got to do with this? You're a wizard, Bradley. Are you excited? We're heading in? You gotta show me the way since you're the wizard here. I've made it. Gonna go check out Ollivander, see what the weight is. Wow, look at all the wands. Right there. And then I'll have you guys sit well. You come right up. Start filling in that available space in the back for me, please. Wow, do you see all the wands? <laughs> Welcome to all of Anders. Makers of fine walls since three hundred and eighty two BC. I am the wand keeper. And I sense if very, very powerful magic in this. Bradley did not get picked. Uh, two brothers, much older than Bradley, got picked. Uh, little Buns, Bradley like wore his robes and he really wanted to get picked. He was really excited. And he was the only one like in a Harry Potter outfit, even a Harry Potter shirt. Uh, so, a little bum. So what wand did you get? Harry Potter's. I thought you were gonna get Voldemort's. <laughs> Don't play with that. Don't. No. All right, Bradley's first trick. Are you ready? wears the headphones for the sound. She doesn't like loud noises. And I think about 20 team members like checked us on it. I guess uh, they have to make sure it doesn't fall off. He had to shake his head. Then someone else was like, oh, I have to check him. And then they were making calls and they already did. Uh, and then we had to sit in the last row, which is the scariest row because you tilt the most and it's the biggest drop and he doesn't like drops because in case it did, I guess, fly off, you're not hitting anyone. But they were very intense with checking it. So if you have those, make sure they're very tight on your head, otherwise they cannot wear it. I also got the fanny pack that I've been looking everywhere for the past year or two. They had it in the store. And it fits a lot more than my other one did. Woo! You did it! If you want to escape the crowds, because of course it is the most crowded in the Harry Potter areas. You come into Nocturne Alley, sit in a corner. It's air conditioned and much quieter and not as crazy with people. Hey, what's up, youngster? What's up, my young brother? What's up, my brother? Say hi. What's your name, man? Bradley, bye. Bye, see you. Bye. <laughs> oh, did he hear you? Beep, 
park, pigeon. Okay. Just went on Men in Black and had the issue with the headphones again. And that ride, I don't know, they're very like weird about that ride with like the bags and stuff. I think they think it's like Velocicoaster. They're very weird about it. And we had to get actually get off the line, uh, wait for a lead who asked, had to ask Bradley certain questions, didn't have to shake his head, just was asking if he's okay with spinning. I think that's the only question they asked. But then once again, we, were, we had to sit in the back in case it fell off. And then we were about to get on the ride and another team member was like, nope, we have to approve it. So like, no one, like everyone's just like, no, you can't go on with those, I don't know. Uh, and then with my glasses, they want me to put it on my shirt and I was holding it. And I was like, I feel safer holding them than keeping it there. I feel like that would fall off more. They're very strict with that ride. <laughs> They think it's a lot faster and does a lot more. I don't know. But I guess we'll see with the headphones if this keeps happening. This is our first year using them. But Daddy skipped Men in Black and this is where we found him. At Duff's Bar. Same spot as last time I was here. I'm heading into the quickie market because I need my giant donut. We are heading out of the parks. It is about a little after 5.30. The plan today wasn't even to come into the parks. So we were supposed to have a pool day, uh, but we are a theme park family. <laughs> so just came in for a little bit. We decided to do the wand and his robe today since we were, weren't gonna st like have a whole day here and it's hot. So for him to wear it, for us to hold it, we don't have the stroller. So we are heading to get some pizza because it's our favorite. And the rain is also supposed to come. And it's supposed to be like a steady lawn rain. So I figured we would go back to the room, check out the room, and relax before the few days that we are here. The rain is a-coming. They put down the shields at Red Oven and a lot of people are leaving. I got my usual, the Big Eye Pepperoni. My favorite pizza. And we got a regular cheese. And a stagio. It's eggplant and burrata. Oh, eggplant burrata. A white pie and then a margarita. What happened? It's raining! Ah! Uh, it's raining! The bus, it is all of the bigger hotels. Hard Rock, Portofino, Royal Pacific, and Sapphire Falls. As you can tell, I'm all wet. The bus stop that drop us off was like by the convention center so we still had to walk outside so we are all wet and we had to go back and check in even though we checked in this morning because they said our room was ready we got room keys this morning but they said no those room keys are don't work you have to come down and get one so we waited online this morning for like 45 minutes to do that and then we didn't need to because we still had to go back <laughs> so we're seeing where our room is and then Hang in there, and I'll show you what it looks like. We're out at our room at Sapphire Falls. Right when you walk in, there is a pool in here. Then you have the closet space, which has a safe, ironing board, blow dryer, some extra blankets and pillows. Then Bradley is showing off the bathroom area. It's only one sink, but oh, it lights up. Okay, we do have the magnifying mirror. It comes with hand and body wash, lotion, a shower cap. And of course your soap. You have a little bit of space down I don't here. Have then it is the shower. It is a shower, not a tub. It does have a seating area. And it comes with your shampoo and conditioner and bath bar. And then the toilet is in the same as the shower. Don't get to throw down the toilet paper. Come on, throw it. Then you have two beds. It is Beachy themed. You have a desk with a chair. 
And then you have another chair over there. And then your drawer space. Here is four drawers. Then you have a fridge. Watch, watch yourself. And then you have a coffee maker, green tea, decaf, French roast, with some half and halves and all that. And there you go. Our view is nothing. Just trees. Got nothing out there. And just like that, another day has come to an end. It was resort hopping day. Uh, we left the Contemporary at like 11. We just grabbed a quick breakfast at the Contempo Cafe. And then we came to Sapphire Falls. We was hoping our room would be ready, but it wasn't. So we left our bags at the hotel and then went over to studios to do some wand work with Bradley's robe since we weren't planning on staying the whole day. The rain did come a little earlier than we were hoping, so we only did a few things and then rushed to get some dinner at Red Oven so that way we wouldn't get stuck in it. We did have to run through it a little bit, but it is still downpouring now, so we made the right call. It was like an all-day thing, and we technically didn't plan on going into the parks today. It was supposed to be just a resort hopping and pool, but you know us, can't can't not go in. So we're just sitting in the room now, watching my big brother, and see what time we wake up in the morning, see if we can get over for some early morning hours, and see what the day brings. It was very, very crowded today, which we are not used to at Universal. We usually walk on everything, so it was crowded. So we'll see what this weekend brings. But with that, I say, good night everyone.